We're approximately 18 miles out of Cloudcroft, New Mexico, coming from Ruidoso, New Mexico. Beautiful drive through the mountains of uh, New Mexico, this area. And um, the elevation where I am right now is probably a little over 7,000 feet. Uh, it's June, the uh, third week of June, somewhere in there. And the temperature shows to be 74 degrees, 9.45 a.m. And compared to what it is in Texas, this is heaven. Yeah, I have a home base in Capitan, all you know that, or most of you. And I'm just driving through the mountains today. Why? Well, I want to go to Cloudcroft and get me a Dave's Bacon Lettuce Tomato Sandwich. BLT. And on the way, I thought I'd do about 20 videos driving through the mountains. <laughs> I won't do 20, but I'll do a few. Why? Because it to me, these, these videos uh, are the ones I enjoy watching on YouTube without any music or anything, just plain old driving. Uh, sometimes the driver will have a comment. Sometimes they don't. Uh, there is a YouTube channel I watch occasionally called Watched Walker out of, I think he's out of London, England mainly, and he just walks around and doesn't say anything. And his videos are extremely popular. Would driving around not saying anything work? Probably. So why don't I shut up? Okay. I can do that.
I know we've done these drives before, but we haven't done them today. Elevation here is about 7,500 feet, approximately. We go up to 8,500 feet when we arrive in Cloudcroft, New Mexico. And this is in June Signs said, watch for snow plows. We don't have many of those signs in Texas.
Did I hit you? Why did you hit me? I was going to walk with the dog. Couldn't have picked a better place. According to that mileage marker, we're eight miles from cloud cars. Temperature has dropped down to 73 degrees. We're climbing on up in the elevations. Mountains to the left of us, mountains to the right of us. We're surrounded. Got a cattle guard here, you're going to hear a little noise. Another cattle guard. See those big boulders on the side of the road there? There's actually somebody that comes along with a machine. Like it's got a blade like a grater. Pushes all those off the road. Sometimes they get one so big that the roads are blocked for a while. Or a tree falls across the road.
leave that right there. Could have stayed at home and done nothing today, but it always seems doing something is better. Doing nothing ain't bad. I'm pretty good at it. Temperatures drop down now to 70 degrees as we climb. Yeah, here's something I've never figured out. If heat rises, you know, like if you're in a home, the heat rises to the roof. Well, if heat rises, why isn't it warmer in the mountains, in the elevations, and cooler in the lower part? ears are popping now. How long does it take to get over here from Capitan, New Mexico? For me, about an hour and a half. It's not that far in distance, it's probably, I don't know, 75 miles. But you can't go very fast on this road. 45 is about tops, which is fine with me. Temperatures drop down now at 67. That's why I didn't stay in Cloudcroft, man. It, it never warms up. Yeah, I bought me a place here and kept it for one month in the summer, two years ago, I think, or whenever it was. Might have been last summer. It's a beautiful place. Beautiful view, but cold. <laughs> Shows we got two miles to go, so we'll just go all the way in in this video to Cloudcroft. And when I park to hook up my electric car at Otero Free Cert RV, or excuse me, Free EV Charger, if it's available, which I give it about a 3 in 10 chance. Because this is a Saturday. A lot of people will be coming up for the weekend.
driving through this in a car is enjoyable. Driving through this in a motor home, uh, coming this way to Cloud Grove wouldn't be bad at all. Coming from Alamogordo, it's tough climbing the mountain. Coming from Rodoso, it's nothing. Just a lot of curves. Temperature now 66 at 10.07 a.m. People in Texas have been killed for this. I know, I'm one of them. Getting car sick yet? <laughs> Got a lot of national forest campgrounds here. I'm not sure how many are free and how many are charged. But you can find out by calling the Forest Service in Cloudcroft and ask them. Or go online and get a map. We'll turn right at this stop sign, go just a little way, and we'll be in. Cloudcroft, and I'll end this video that has gone on for a while. Turn left to go to Mayhill, turn right to go to Cloudcroft and Alamogordo. Shows it's a 6% grade, which may not sound like much. But when you're going down the mountain, I promise you, you are aware of it. the Sacramento Mountains and here we are this is Cloudcroft Saturday morning uh, what is this the third week of June I guess close Because of its proximity to Alamogordo, it's not uh, that pricey. In other words, when you eat out or if you have to go to a little grocery or dollar store and stuff, they don't just rob you. you know what I mean? it's, it's pretty good. I, of course, I stayed here for a month when I was living in my house here. We're headed for the Otero Electric charging station. I mean, I've got plenty of range. I don't, I can, I don't have to charge. I'm, I'm in an electric vehicle, a Chevy Bolt 2LT 2022. Uh, if I can move my turn now. Uh, this is right here. I mean, there is a car so close, I can see their dashboard. <laughs> Okay, here we go, guys. This is downtown Cloudcroft, Borough Avenue. This is where it all happens on Borough Avenue. And now, uh, it 
looks like the EV charging spot is taken, unfortunately. And you know what it is? It's not an electric vehicle that's in there. It's just some brain dead idiot. <laughs> you believe that? Uh, electric vehicles only. Well, I guess they have one of those hybrids that you can charge a little bit. Anyway, we'll forget that plan. I kind of I gave that a three in ten chance. Turn the camera around here so you can see what's happening. Dave's is right up here on the right. Yeah, this is a busy, of course, this is the tourist season. It's a weekend. It's hot in Alamo Gardo. You know, it's going to be busy, busy, busy today for sure. I was expecting to see more Texas license plates, but because of the heat wave, in uh, Alamo Gardo, uh, there's not that many Texas plates here. Yeah, I could park right here if I wanted to, but I'm not. Why? I don't know why. I don't know why she's falling to fly. Let's see here. Park over there. There's one right there. Rusty one. I don't like to park between cars all that much. But you know, if somebody just swings their door open and dings your vehicle. I've actually parked at the post office before, which is right there on the right. Okay. Oh. I think I'm going to go right here. I think I am. Okay, let me get this thing where I can end it. You're good. Anyway, guys, thumbs up. Carpe diem. Adios. Bye-bye. Buy anything you want, use the Amazon link, drink plenty of water, keep your health and enjoy your life the best you can. Yeah, take a drive if you want to.